and interesting individuals. It's 2002, 2003, New Year's Eve. John Baines joins me. We're here at Leroy's in Porter on Highway 20. This is the 10th year in a row I'm going to be ringing in the New Year on TV. Please stay tuned. Once again, Bill Landing back with you on Interesting Individuals. We are inside Leroy's, getting ready to ring in the new year. And joining me is a West Coast man, J.J. Garcia. J.J., what brings you to the Midwest? Uh, well, I'm for originally from this area. So uh, even though I reside in Los Angeles, I'm um, actually an uh, Indiana native. And I'm hanging out with uh, my cousin and her uh, husband right now, So, which you can't see, but they're behind you. And we're having a good time. We're all here to ring in the new year. Alrighty, and you are in the music industry out in California. Please explain. I play in a band called Stone, and uh, we come back to the area quite often. Right now, we're currently working on our third uh, record. Um, so we play Leroy's a lot. Leroy gave us a big break out here when we started playing the Midwest uh, when no one would have us. And uh, now we play House of Blues and uh, play everywhere else across the country. And, uh, you know, it's good to know that, you know, that he was one of the first people to give us our start. And how many are in your band? Uh, there's three of us. Uh, I play drums, and then we have uh, our bass player, Brian James, uh, who sings as well, and then uh, Brad Wilson, who sings and plays guitar, and is a primary songwriter of the band. And you say you are working on your third album right now? Yeah, we're hoping to have it released uh, nationwide, uh, probably coming uh, this April, April or May. And um, if you want to check out for any information, you can go to stonelive.com. Uh, we'll have some new songs up there before the album's released. You'll be able to download some stuff and check it all out. Good enough. And you say that you've done some touring around the country. As we're getting into 2003, what are some of the areas you'd like to hit? Well, obviously, we'll come back here. I mean, that's just, you know, that's a, that's a given. Um, but um, also some of the venues that we played uh, on the last tour, touring for the last album for the last two years, we definitely want to revisit. You know, we got to share the stage with a lot of cool bands, you know, Cheap Trick, Tonic, 38 Special, uh, you know, Violent Femmes even, you know, we played all over the country, we've been there ten times over, so, I mean, we had some great opportunities, and we're hoping just to kind of redo that, you know, we took a little bit of a break, uh, really concentrated on working on this new record, and, you know, coming back here always rejuvenates me a lot, you know, and uh, it's, it's cool because a lot of people just walking around and stuff have been asking about the band, and, uh, you know, I'm, I'm really excited. Tell me, please, JJ, where do you see the music industry going in this next upcoming year? Well, you know, I mean, it's changed dramatically, you know, uh, with different resources, you know, uh, being able to, you know, get music off the Internet, being able to download stuff, um, you know, so it's obviously changed a lot. And, and also, um, you know, just, you know, you don't just go into and buy a CD anymore as much as you used to. So, you know, it's um, it's going to change uh, dramatically. It's just depending on how uh, we decide to embrace it and what we decide to do. Uh, you know, I still go out and buy CDs. You know, I'm, a, I'm one of those guys that likes to get it and physically have something tangible. But there's a lot of people that download music and stuff, and I support that because that's helped us a lot. You know, uh, I mean, there's other countries that we've never been to that we get letters and emails from all the time because they were able to get our music, you know, from our website. You know, Japan, Netherlands, Australia, people that we wouldn't have met unless we toured out there were able to come and see us and come and check out, you know, via the Internet. So it's, it's for us, it's, it's been great. You know, and, um, you know, but there's also both sides of the fence as well. So I think uh, the best thing to do is have the industry embrace it and do the best they can and uh, make it work for us instead of against us. Sounds really good. JJ, you and your band have a great new year, and thank you so much for visiting with us. Thanks very much. I appreciate it. We'll see you. I have some more New Year's revelers here at Leroy's in Porter on Highway 20 taking some time to join me, and I have Dennis Jean-Pierre, and I have... Elois John Pierre, thank you. And where are you folks from now? Calumet City, Illinois. Alrighty, what brings you down to Indiana to uh, Leroy's? Well, he's an old friend of mine. So I decided to drop by and see him for the new year, just before the new year began. So you have been down here before I take it? Yes, I have. Alrighty, gonna ring in the new year with the band White Dove. Have you seen them perform before? No, I haven't. I haven't seen them before. Alrighty. Well, do you have any New Year's resolutions this year? <laughs> No, just practically the same old ones. Want to pay off all my bills and hopefully hit the big one. Okay, I'm going to try to take a guess. All my bills means everything you owe and the big one like a lottery? Yes. Yes. Uh, <laughs> well, you give me your phone number because if you win, I'll be calling you, all right? Because we've known each other for 25 years. Yeah. 
How about you, Dennis? My resolution is uh, about the same. Okay. Help for everyone, and I hope it'll be a better year this year for everyone. Good enough. Enjoy yourself tonight, and Happy New Year to you. Thank you. Well, this guy here is really into the New Year's celebration. This is Leroy's son. And your name, please? Leroy. Okay. Well, what all are your duties this evening? What my dad tells me to. What's that been so far? Putting the food out, helping, um, probably help do stuff later when we get done with everything, like close everything back up. And I, at about 11, I had to put, start handing out party favors so, to everybody that's been here. Handing out the party favors, you're going to ring in the new year and get excited and holler and yell? Oh, yeah. I always do. Well, we'll let you get back to work. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Bye. <laughs> The band White Dove performing here at Leroy's New Year's Eve 2002. Uh, we want to wish every what's happening here a uh, uh, very, 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 very happy new year. Have delayed. Does everybody have a good time? I said, does everybody have a good time? Well, this song right here is for all the people that like to ride around the plane. I'm talking about the red, white, and blue.
How's everybody doing tonight? Hey, look. Ooh. The party continues here at Leroy's New Year's Eve 2002 on Interesting Individuals, and everybody is really into it now. And please, sir, your name? Ed Zarich, and my beautiful wife, Denise, uh, who's from Houston, Texas. <laughs> All righty, where are you from? Where are you residing now? We're in Chesterton. Nearby then. All righty. Well, are you a regular here at Leroy's? Oh, yes. Well, Leroy's is one of my best buddies, and this is a great place to eat and a good place to come and just socialize. Sounds good. I like the way they have the place decorated tonight, and the band sounds really good. Yeah, they are we're glad to our brains out. <laughs> well, we're glad to be here. Well, tell me, do you have any New Year's resolutions this year? I'll start yes. with you. Uh, I've decided to quit drinking. <laughs> Actually, that, that's really what I've decided. Well, that's that's a good one. That's after tonight. Yeah, well, January 1st, I understand. Yeah, we'll let you extend it into an hour or two in the first of the year. Right. How about you? I have a real easy resolution every year. I'm just going to be as sweet next year as I was this year. <laughs> okay, now it's your turn to comment there. Uh, no comment. I plead the fifth. <laughs> All right, we don't want to have to edit anything out here, right? No comment. Uh, <laughs> All right, thank you for coming on. Thank you. All right, all right. Edit the whole thing. We have more people joining us here, ringing the new year at Leroy's, and I'm telling you, this place has got a following all over the United States. You're from where now? Bismarck, North Dakota. North Dakota, both of you? Yes. Are you from the Indiana area originally? No. No. Just passing through. Just passing through. Yep. And you made you decided to stop here, the happening place tonight, right? New Year's Eve. That's right. That's right. This is it. This is where it. Where are you heading, or coming from, rather, Which, whichever? All over the country, we're truckers. Oh, okay. All righty. So how do you like the atmosphere so far? Oh, it's great. It's, it's blast. I love it. And your names, please? John. Lori. All And I didn't mean to block you folks out, but you're, right. uh, let's have your names, please. Have a good time. Jim. And Lori. And you're from? Chesterton. Portage. How about that? Okay. We've got some people nearby that come here, too. Are you regulars here? Yes. Mm -hmm. All righty. Leroy's a good friend of ours. He's a good friend of everybody's. That's good to know. So tell me what's going to be going on with you at midnight. You're going to be going crazy.